So if you go to your GP with symptoms like uh, breathlessness, dizziness, even palpitations, uh, your GP is likely to want to do a, uh, something called an auscultation, which is a listening of your heart sounds. So we've got Keith here, who's a trustee of Heart Valve Voice. If I could just demonstrate to you, Keith, if you could just undo the buttons of your chest, so just what you might expect uh, to happen when you go to see your GP. Ideally, your GP is likely to want to put you lying on a couch at about 45 degrees, but because we haven't got one, we'll make do with a slightly compromised position here. So the, your GP is going to listen to several areas on your chest. He'll probably first listen to the right side here, which uh, we can listen for uh, any murmurs coming from your aortic valve, which is one of the valves of the heart. Then he'll move to this part of your chest to listen for another uh, murmur coming from the pulmonary valve. That's another valve uh, of the heart. And he's going to move the stethoscope down to listen to another heart valve. And then across to listen to the uh, final heart valve uh, in the heart. He's probably going to use this part of the stethoscope initially and he may well flip it over to use the other part which actually listens for more low pitched uh, frequencies that you often get particularly on the mm, in this right. part of the uh, uh, of the heart mm. and then ideally for completeness he may well ask you to roll over onto your left side I won't ask you to do that because you'll end up on the floor if you roll over onto your left side because uh, that can help uh, increase the sound coming from murmurs particularly from here and then he'll also probably finish by getting you to sit up lean forwards and hold your breath after blowing everything out of your chest. And if you just hold your breath there, he'll probably have another listen in because that can also make some of the murmurs, in particularly the, the murmur from uh, the aortic valve, aortic regurgitation, we call it, uh, a bit louder. And that essentially is a complete uh, auscultation or, or listening uh, for heart sounds that you would expect from your GP.